What is going on you guys? Brandon here, AKA Brawadis, and today I'm going to be making the world's biggest quesadilla. So in front of me, I have all the ingredients I will need to make this quesadilla, starting with a bunch of huge tortillas. Then we have a ton of cheese. Look at all these bags of cheese. And then our choice of protein for this quesadilla is chicken. We butterflied a bunch of chicken right here. Now let's see how big we can make this quesadilla. Let's go, guys. So I was about to start working on this quesadilla for the video, but then I thought about it. It wouldn't feel right making the world's biggest quesadilla without the king of building the world's biggest thing. Yeah! Papa Rock! Let's go! You ready to make the world's biggest Good. quesadilla? We have a lot of work to do. Let's go make the quesadilla! <laughs> Let's go guys. So everybody knows step one to making a quesadilla is getting the tortillas cooked. How many can we fit on this right now, Dad? Probably four. Four? Okay, okay. And one over there, one over here. So guys, usually if you're making quesadillas, people make them in their kitchen. But when you're making the world's biggest quesadilla, you need a lot of space, you need a big flame. So we're actually out here in the backyard using our fire pit, bro. A lot of people like to use a fire pit to sit around the campfire, get warm. Us, the Awadis family, we use the fire pit to make the world's biggest foods. Look at that. Oh, look, the tortilla's actually cooking quick. And now we put them here. Dude, I'm excited. I love quesadillas. Guys, look at this. Get a close-up. These look beautiful. But it's time to get these off. There you go. Put them on the little pan. See, this is how I like my tortilla, with just a little crisp and a little burn just on the edges. I feel like that crisp adds a little bit of flavor. All right, guys, now that we've got all of our tortillas cooked, it's time for step two, which is getting the chicken cooked. So we have a bunch of seasoned chicken. Look at this ASMR once it hits the grill. Listen, listen. When we say making the world's biggest quesadilla, it's not cap. Look at all this chicken we have in the tray. Look at this. We have a lot of chicken. You saw all the tortilla we were making. This is really gonna be the world's biggest quesadilla. Guinness Book of World Records. Hit me up. Yeah. I'm gonna let Papa Rug, who's probably better than me at cooking, do some work because I'm probably gonna mess it up if I do all the work. Okay, I have an idea, Dad. What? How about you work on the chicken uh -huh. and I'm gonna go work on getting some sides ready for the quesadilla. Deal? Oh yeah. That way you can leave me here by myself. To anybody who has parents out there that actually love you, I'm jealous of you guys. So we are making a quesadilla today, so I got some guacamole for the side. Ooh. Dude! You are making the biggest, the world's biggest quesadilla, so what we need is the biggest guac. How about that? Okay, then I guess we're making the world's biggest guacamole for the world's biggest quesadilla. Let's do it. Guys, for those who don't know, my mom is the queen at making guacamole. Oh, well, so thank you. you're welcome. That's okay, good. mom, so what are we gonna start with first? We're gonna okay. open Here's the knife. avocados. Okay, one. Okay, How do we one. do this? Can you teach uh, me? I'll teach you. Okay. I just go like this. Okay. Okay. So you make a little slit. Oh, that's it? Yeah, take oh. this out. Seems easy. Let me see how okay. easy. Do Be careful. That. Oh, Be shit. Careful. It almost went through the whole thing. Okay. You squeeze. You're better than me. Wow. Get this. Bring the bowl. So we're going to scoop it out, Mom? Mm-hmm. Easy. This. Boom. Brandon, you know it will be easier like to go and buy guac ready from the store, mm -hmm. but it's always better to make it at home. Homemade! While you finish preparing the guac, I'm gonna go check on Pops and just see how the chicken is doing, okay? Okay, I'll see you. Booker, you haven't made an appearance in today's video. What's up, what's up, what's up, how are you? Say what's up, say hi, Bookie. We're gonna go check on my dad, okay? Oh my gosh, bro. Look this that. looks so good. Look at this. Can we get a listen? But a sizzle, listen. Mm -hmm. a quesadilla, yeah, the cheese is important, the tortillas are important, but if you're making a chicken quesadilla, the chicken needs to be tasting good. So look at this. I know you guys can't taste it, but come on. You can always tell how good food is gonna taste just by how it looks. And I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong, but this looks amazing. It looks golden. You're doing a beautiful job. It looks really good, it looks perfect. I'm gonna go back and help Mama Rug, yeah? So is the next step mashing all the avocado? Yes, you can do that. Ah, ah. I just want to rock, 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 body, yeah, 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 yeah. Show you the body, yeah, yeah. How much do I mash it, mom? A little bit more. This already looks good. Uh -huh. Let's not forget. <laughs> Come on now, guac isn't just avocado. We got the onions, we got the tomatoes, we got the cilantro. 
and we got salt and lemon, freshly squeezed lemon juice. <laughs> like my mom said, you could buy stuff that are already ready from the store, but everything tastes better homemade. The lemon juice? Yeah, for half for mm. now. Half? Yeah, and then when we have the other stuff, we can mash a little bit more. Okay. Mix it all together. Oh my gosh, guys. So Booker is always around me or my mom. He loves us. However, there's an exception. When there's food on that barbecue grill, <laughs> get a zoom in on him. Oh, now you want to go in the backyard. Now you want to go in the backyard. But when I try to get you to go out there to go pee and use the bathroom and go potty, you don't want to go, huh? No, stay inside. You're not going out there, no. Now it's time to add the finishing touches to this guac. We got our diced onion going right in there. We have some cilantro, tomato right over here. Ooh, so good. We put some lemon earlier, but we're gonna add a little bit more because you can never go wrong with some lemon. Mm -hmm. He knows how. He knows how. Some lemon. Ooh. And then mom, I think we need a little bit of salt. Okay. Just a little bit. <laughs> I know it. <laughs> Ooh. Mom, do me a huge favor. Yes. I know you put me in charge of the mashing earlier. Now I'm going to put you in charge of the mashing because I need to go check on Papa Rug and the chicken because I'm pretty sure that chicken is ready by now. Okay, so I'll see you guys. I'll see you, Mom. You know what? I love ASMR, so let's get an ASMR on her mashing it real quick. Hear that. Look. Valentine's Day just passed. I'm sure a lot of people watching this video was hearing a lot of that in the bedroom. Excuse my... Uh, get out of here! <laughs> excuse my use of words, Mom, but uh, come on, let's be real. Let's go check on the chicken. Oh my God, is that Kareem Benzema? Ah. Hi, Jay! Hello, brother. <laughs> How's the chicken looking? Pretty good, you wanna uh, try it? I do actually wanna try it, please. A lot of chopping. <laughs> Dad, how'd the chicken come out? It's coming up good. Look at it. All right, okay, we're almost ready. We're almost ready, man. I was looking out in the kitchen. The guac is looking good. You made it? Yeah, yeah. sorta. Oh, wait. Quesadilla, guacamole, and what are we missing? There's something that goes next to the guacamole. Cheese. The cheese is in the quesadilla. There's something that goes on the side. Sour cream. Sour cream, let's go. <laughs> Hey mom, um, guac is looking good. You know, I love you. I had a lot of fun making this guac with you. Okay. But I'm sorry, I don't have the patience to home make the sour cream, so <laughs> we're gonna get these tubs emptied out in this bowl right now. Ooh, world's biggest sour cream. I just spilled it all over my world's biggest jacket. Come on, I know you're in there. Oh my God, it looks like vanilla ice cream. Okay guys, so we got the tortillas cooked. Papa Rug got the chicken ready. Mama Rug made the guac. We got the sour cream right here, but you guys might be a little confused. Yo, Brandon, you keep saying you're making a quesadilla. You haven't mentioned anything about cheese. How could you make a quesadilla without cheese? Well, you're right, it's not possible. So now let's get the cheese taken care of. So we're gonna go with two different types of cheeses. We got our mozzarella cheese. We're gonna dump in the bowl. Our cheddar cheese, we're gonna throw into this bowl. This might look like enough cheese, but remember guys, world's biggest quesadilla. So we're gonna go ahead and get all this cheese in there. I love cheese by itself so much. Ooh. Now that we've got all of our ingredients ready, we're gonna push those off to the side, and now it's time to actually start building the world's biggest quesadilla. We got all of our tortillas. Go ahead, guys, just look. I trust you guys more than I trust myself. Whatever you guys do, I'm not gonna question it, okay? Okay. Who wants to be the first? Oh, okay. look at this. All right, guys, so we got the first layer of the quesadilla done. The bottom, how's it looking? Dude, it's huge. Great. Crazy. So we have 18 big tortillas that are layering the bottom. Now it's time for some freaking cheese. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone grab some cheese and start dumping. Go, go, go. Okay. Okay. Hey, and don't be shy with the cheese. This is a quesadilla. Cheese is its middle name. No, I think for quesadilla, cheese is its first name. <laughs> so once we start getting the cheese, we are going to go in with some chicken. Ooh, look at this. 
Hey, these low-key look like Chick-fil-A nuggets. I swear. Hey, I just want to apologize to everybody watching this video. If you don't have food in front of you right now, go get yourself a snack. I'm advising you guys. This quesadilla is gonna come out looking delicious. So if you don't have a snack in front of you right now, go get yourself a snack and continue watching this video, man. Okay, so we got the chicken scattered around and then we're gonna go ahead and hit it with some mozzarella cheese. My favorite. I know, mom, I love mozzarella cheese. Okay, dude, this looks amazing. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Now that we've got the cheese on here, oh come look, on. Look at this, hold on, give it a minute. It looks good, <laughs> don't get me wrong. It looks amazing, but you don't eat a quesadilla with cold cheese. You gotta melt the cheese. That's what makes a quesadilla so good. This is gonna be so bomb. What are you doing, Brandon? Move! Move! Oh, oh shoot! Oh, oh my oh, goodness! Long time to do this. Dude! Do this. <laughs> hey, you got the biggest, biggest quesadilla. He's not gonna damage with this one, okay? Okay, okay. <laughs> wow. Look how the cheese is melting! Oh. Using a little lighter. Now that we've got all the cheese melted, it's time to throw the last layer of the tortilla on top. This is the finishing touches, yo. This thing is almost done. I'm so excited to eat it, bro. I can't wait. All right, guys, so the quesadilla is officially done, but the tortillas have been sitting around for a little while. They might've got a little cold. So we're gonna finish this quesadilla off by toasting the top for a little bit. Yum. Hey guys, look how good this looks. Look, let's take a look at the inside of one. Oh my goodness, dude. This looks so good with all the cheese melted and everything. Okay, mom, dad, now that the quesadilla is done, I think it's time to cut some portions up so we can all enjoy it for dinner. Oh my goodness. What? <laughs> you can't tell me this isn't the world's biggest quesadilla. Look at this. Oh my God, oh. dad. Ah. Look at this piece. <laughs> Bro. Okay guys, so we each have a slice of a quesadilla, but come on bro, you need some guac. Mom, here you go. Oh, my Dad, God. oh, okay, oh. man. It's time to try this. Ready guys? Two, one, go! Mmm. Mmm. Oh my God. Wait. The best. This is actually really good, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. This is what the quesadilla all about. Salty, guacamole, chicken, Good. Okay. Listen, hey, Dennis, <laughs> give me the camera. You got to try it. Jay, you too, you too. Okay, we got our guests for tonight trying the quesadilla. Hey, I honest really review. So I'm honest, yeah. honest review, Bro. honest review. Okay. That's fire. Fire? Fire. Honestly, it's really good. Good? I gotta wow. say one thing though, I'm not gonna lie. Yes. Wow. I feel disrespected. Why? Why? When you needed a guac, you got a professional, you called your mom. When you needed a chef to cook your chicken, you called your dad. When you needed a professional eater, why didn't you call me? <laughs> what am I doing here then, bro? You're lost. Oh my god, Pop Rug is going ham! Oh my Dude, this is the best place I have alright. Dude, breathe, breathe. It's okay to breathe, fam. Oh yeah? How is it? Bomb. So good. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Please drop a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to this YouTube channel if you are new. And everybody, do me a huge favor. So today we made the world's biggest quesadilla. I want all you guys to comment down below what biggest food we should make next. I'm thinking maybe a burger, a pizza. I don't know. Give me some suggestions in the comment section down below. Other than that, it has been your boy, Brandon, a.k.a. Bawadis. Maparag! Maparag! And we are out. Peace! Peace.